Okay, so it is time for the highly requested Ohio State football prediction. Now, before I start, there's going to be some Ohio State fans that have probably never seen my channel. I know I'm a Clemson fan, so don't dislike the video immediately. Yo, what is going on, guys? It's Clemson Fan 1 or College Football Fan 1, whatever you want to call me on the channel. Today, I have Ohio State's football prediction, and I'm going to go ahead and say, on a serious note, um, everyone, I, I've been... Um, I never really talked about this for some reason, but I need to talk about it to address it about the Ohio State football Clemson uh, refereeing questions. I'm one and one on them. Uh, the first one in targeting, in my opinion, it was targeting. I think helmet to helmet, uh, crown of the helmet is targeting, in my opinion. I just thought that was targeting. Um, I thought that was the right call. Um, you can say that's me being a Clemson fan a little bit, but I thought that was a targeting. Um, but the the um the fumble was a fumble. Uh, I don't know why that wasn't a fumble. But you can't say Ohio State would have won the game 30 to 29 because Clemson Clemson had a few chances that they didn't go in. Of course, Clemson's gonna be going on fourth down and um, on a on a few uh, plays. And plus, we missed a field goal early in the game. So um you know there's some plays. So you know you know you can go different ways. Feel free to leave your comments in the comments below if uh, what you thought about the calls. Uh, I'm 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 willing to listen to anyone. Uh, about the calls you can make your case in the comment section below and i'll agree with you no matter what opinions are opinions and this is my own opinion but you can stand by your opinion in the comments section all right so how this works is if you don't know i go over i go over the 2019 schedule i go over your recruiting class and then i, I pick your games and i'm actually going to pick them by the actual scores so here we go last year recap um the guy justin fields out of, out of georgia a uh, really high recruit so this is how he did. Um, beat Florida Atlantic 45-21. Beat Cincinnati 42-0. That was impressive. Uh, beat Indiana 51-10. Crushed Miami, Ohio 76-5 after Miami, Ohio was up 5-0. Uh, crushed on the road in Nebraska 48-7. Uh, beat Michigan State 34-10. Was off. Then on the road in, uh, Friday against Northwestern won 52-3. Uh, Wisconsin beat them 38-7. That's when I thought Ohio State was absolutely legit. Um, beat, uh, beat Maryland 73-14. On the road at Rutgers, fifty. On the road at Rutgers, fifty-six twenty-one. The Penn State game, twenty-eight seventeen. Very well done. And then Michigan, fifty-six to twenty-seven. That was very well done as well. Um, and then the Big Ten championship after being down twenty-one-seven would score twenty-seven uh, extra points, and then would lose to Clemson in the Fiesta Bowl, twenty-nine to twenty-three. So we have the recruiting class. I'm going to name, I'm name a few names. Um, they signed, I believe that is. Three five stars, not bad. Julian Fleming, number one receiver. Paris Johnson, number one offensive tackle, and Jake Jackson Smith Nijaba, um, number fifth wide receiver. And they also signed a nice quarterback in CJ Stroud, G. Scott Jr., Mookie Cooper, Luke Weifold, Larry Henry, Jacoby Cowan, Court Williams, Ryan Watts, you know, really good class. Jack Miller, Cody Simpson, Lathan Wampson. These are all four stars I'm reading, by the way. Mitchell Melton and Cameron Martinez. Very good class. Fifth in the nation, first in the Big Ten, and their class even better. Their class is even better next year, first in the um, first in the country, first in the Big Ten. Ohio State has kind of owned the Big Ten this uh, decade, or the last decade, I should say, since we're in the 20s now, 2020s. Um, so, yeah, uh, respect. Ohio State has put on a great uh, class, and uh, Ryan Day looks to be the right fit at coach. Will they win a national championship this year? What we'll to see? Um, so I'm gonna go. So this is where it goes. I just you know look at the teams, do predictions, and say why. All right, all right, you guys know. Bowling Green. Um, I think they're gonna win by like uh, 66 to tw uh, 66 21. They'll have some some backups, give up a few touchdowns, but they'll 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 put on an, a clinic um, and be ready to go to Eugene at, at week two. I got them winning on the road, 37 to 20. Um, I think that Oregon is gonna not have any answers for Ohio State's uh, amazing offense, and um, their defense is gonna be on the field. I think Oregon's will be solid at the defense. That prediction will be coming later, um, but I think Oregon will just be, will, just won't be ready. Buffalo, um, I think they'll blow them out. 56-21 um, will go, a nice 35-point um, win. Rutgers, same thing. They'll 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 put on seventy against Rutgers. We'll go seventy to fourteen. Nice fifty-six point win. On the road, I mean off, and then Iowa. 
Uh, Iowa could give some people problems, but I think they'll. I think they can beat Iowa. I'll go 35-10. Michigan State on the road. Sparties got a good defense, but not a great offense. We'll go. We'll go 31. We'll go 31 to 10. Uh, we'll go 30. No, we'll go 31-7. Uh, Michigan State has scored 10 points. All right. This is a game that's been talked about a lot on my channel. Uh, Ohio State at Penn State. I like Ohio State on the road winning 31-21. I just think – I don't think Penn State – I do think Penn State's going 11-1 or 10-2 and or something like that. Uh, this could be their best year ever. But um, I like Ohio State winning that one. Nebraska, I'm not buying any hype for Nebraska. I just think Ohio State is way better than Nebraska. I like – um, hmm, we'll go 48-17 Ohio State. Indiana, Indiana's a little sleeper team. They were – they were, they were quiet in the Big Ten, but um, I like oh, uh, Indiana. I like Ohio State, not Indiana. 45-17. Um, uh, another blowout um, is the main point. Uh, I like on the road of Maryland. Um, shouldn't be any trouble, although they had trouble there two years ago. But I like Ohio State crushing Maryland, like 62-14. to 14. On the road of Illinois, shouldn't be that hard as well. 55-17, to 17, sure. And then Michigan, did they finally beat them? Absolutely not. Uh, 42-24 Ohio State. Big Ten Championship against Wisconsin or Minnesota or Iowa, in my opinion. I didn't play Minnesota, and I think they'll beat Minnesota by, like, two to three touchdowns. So, yep, I have them 13-0. Worst case scenario, 9-3. Um, and 9-3 and is not a bad record, by the way. 9-3, you know how desperate South Carolina would go to be 9-3? It would be really desperate. So, yeah, take that uh, for granted. But um, I think Ohio State 12-0. and I just think they're going to be 12-0. and Um... Ohio, Ohio State haters, which I, I I do not like Ohio State, but I do respect them, um, would say 10-2 and two or 9-3. and three, Lost it to Michigan, Penn State, and Oregon. But that's that's about it. Um, but um, it's going to be interesting um, for this year to see. Ohio State and Clemson probably have a lot of hype around them. So um, it's going to be interesting. Justin Fields is projected to win the Heisman. So it's going to be an interesting year for the Buckeyes and Ryan Day. Will we see you in January? Will we even make it in January? Y'all even make it in January. We'll have to see. Put your comments below. What is Ohio State going? Are they going? Are they going to go five and seven? Uh, if you pick that, that's kind of stupid. They're not going five and seven. Are they going to go, they going to go ten and two? Are they going to go eleven and one? Twelve and zero? Are they going to have what they did a few years ago and bust out a bad a game against Purdue or Iowa? What's going to happen? Put your comments below. What's Ohio State going? Thank you for watching. God bless.